which is so scary to me because I was trying to save my own life. Really watered that seed of, of my own self-doubt and my own insecurity. Among the latest whispers to capture the industry's attention is the rift between longtime pals Mary J. Blige and Diddy. After years of speculation, the singer has finally broken silence, shedding light on a decades-old mystery surrounding her suspicious proximity to the music mogul. Well, Diddy has been facing one blow after another after his industry friends keep betraying his trust and spill the most shocking stories about his wild lifestyle. And Mary J is not an exception here. It looks like the bitterness of her past still haunts her, and she's ready to spill everything we've been suspecting about Diddy for a long time. You know, just not afraid to let it let people see what it is because I didn't know how to do anything else. Mary J. Blige's connection to Sean Diddy Combs dates back to the 1990s when he produced her first two studio albums. But now, as his legal battles have made headlines with accusations of misconduct casting a shadow over his empire, Mary has decided to send a public message on her social media. Unfortunately, a lot of you all met me when I lacked boundaries and was a people pleaser. Let me reintroduce myself. I burn bridges as needed. Amidst the lawsuits and allegations, it seems like Mary J is ready to spill something the public doesn't know yet. And her own history with Diddy just shows totally misplaced trust and broken promises that this man is infamous for, casting a long shadow over the bad boy's empire. You don't know these things till later, you know? <laughs> and while you're going through it, you just like... In the past, Mary had nothing but words of praise for her mentor and friend, and she always shared how Puff was the one to guide her to greatness when she didn't even believe in her success in Hollywood. As she shared back in 2023 before all that misconduct drama, Puff was a huge inspiration for me. He wanted all of this for me more than I wanted it myself. We all can guess that the allure of Diddy's charm and charisma can be irresistible, and a lot of artists are drawn into a web of his promises. Apparently, Mary was just one of them. Yet, as the harsh reality of her situation became clear, she found herself forced into disadvantageous contracts and other shady stuff Diddy's empire is known for. So, many decades after, Mary bravely unveils the glittering facade of fame and fortune and spills it all about her tumultuous relationship with the music mogul. Challenge because it's new and it's hard. It's really, really hard. Contrary to the image of loyalty and devotion he projected, Diddy reportedly saw Mary as nothing more than a cash cow, exploiting her talents for his own gain. He was my everything. He was my manager, my producer, my boyfriend, my mentor. He made me feel like I was the only one who mattered, but he was lying to me all along. In addition, she said that Diddy was betraying Mary's trust by engaging in relationships with other artists and models while stealing from her royalties and masters. But despite her desire to sever ties with him, the bad boy made it difficult for her. As the singer confessed, he reminded her of her contract and promised to sue her, blacklist her, ruin her reputation, and harm her physically if she left him. Because everything that this man said to me yes. was contrary to mm -hmm. that. As Mary's experience and story gain attention, it becomes clear that she was not alone in her suffering. Countless artists have come forward with similar tales of manipulation and coercion at the hands of Diddy, who allegedly used his power and influence to silence maintain control over his artists and their entire lives. And if you think that folks could just leave him, let me remind you what happened to Biggie Smalls when he allegedly signed a more lucrative deal with another label. As streets are saying, he got eliminated for his disobedience, and fear was the common thing everyone under the bad boy records and Diddy was feeling, including Mary J. Blige. I don't think people understand what it's like to be traumatized by somebody famous and rich, because you can't get away from that. Yet, despite the years of trauma and struggle, Mary found the courage to break free from Diddy's grip, embarking on a journey of self-discovery and healing. She had to go through therapy, sobriety from certain substances she got used to while being with the music mogul and spiritual healing as well. As she recalled, it was not easy to regain full freedom from this man. He was a powerful man in the industry. He had connections everywhere. He had lawyers, bodyguards, hitmen. He had people who would do anything for him. Despite the pain and betrayal she endured, Mary does not regret her past association with Diddy, recognizing the role it played in shaping her into the artist and person she is today. Yet, the story took completely another turn when the feds started to investigate everyone who's been close to the music mogul in the past. Well, Savannah, the allegations are horrific, and if you include not only Sean Diddy Combs... No wonder that Mary J. Blige finally decided to burn all the bridges between herself and the painful past. As many folks on social media are saying, she probably has a lot of stories to share. As one person commented, Puffy used Mary, made her do a lot of things. She saw and done a lot. Puffy was something at Uptown Records, but Mary stood next to him until now. And another user added, These guys we considered idols really went through hell in the hands of this man. Well, all celebs at some point must pick a side. And even if Mary J is all full of forgiveness and gratitude, she doesn't believe this man is innocent. Mary even hinted at Diddy's shady involvement in the tragic demise of Aliyah, 
whose passing in a plane crash has long remained shrouded in mystery. So I would have to really bring proof, you know what I'm saying, for what I learned. And she just was cut down in the prime of her life. But Mary's anguish extends beyond her own experiences and what she has seen. Her past was also marred by a strained relationship with other artists, one of them being under Diddy's mentorship, Faith Evans. What began as a close friendship between the two divas soon soured under the weight of industry pressures and Diddy's manipulations. As Diddy sought to replicate Mary's success with Faith, a sense of competition arose. In a revealing interview, Faith shared her side of the story and the view on the dispute between two women recounting how Mary allegedly sought to remove her vocals from their collaborative track, Love, Don't Live Here Anymore. Initially, I was kind of trying to be cool with her. I mean, I think we were pretty cool. And while many artists stayed under Diddy's wing until the end, Mary decided she needed to make a decision about her separation from Diddy for her own sake. The life was living under Puff Diddy was full of control, certain substances, and the music mogul's business moves, and she wasn't having any of it. Now, she couldn't predict what was about to happen in the future, but as recent events prove, she made a healthy choice. Meanwhile, Diddy's own past seems to be catching up with him with more shocking stories that date back to decade back to decades ago surface. Went through hell, I went through some of the darkest, most disgusting, lost my morals, lost my mind, lost who I was, everything for this man. Lawsuits against the music mogul are nothing new, with Diddy often emerging victorious through legal maneuvering or private settlements. Yet, the latest case filed by producer Rodney Jones is about to end Diddy's empire, alleging the biggest industry misconduct, including inappropriate behavior and involvement in serious crimes. The lawsuit paints a disturbing portrait of Diddy's alleged misuse of power, with the detailed stories of how he was using coercion and manipulation. And let's not forget about his infamous parties, which have long been shrouded in secrecy. Jones mentioned in his lawsuit that Diddy recorded artists without their consent and used the footage for blackmail, creating a culture of fear and intimidation. Just dealing with this, it's, it's, the contract that they gave me and the offer that they gave me was just disgusting. And while Diddy heavily relied on his connections in the industry and beyond, the most unexpected thing happened. The case got a rapid progress, culminating in federal raids on Diddy's residences in Los Angeles and Miami. The raids, which resulted in the seizure of mobile phones and firearms, now promise many interesting and wild stories from the past to be uncovered soon. In a statement, Diddy's attorney called the raids nothing but a witch hunt. However, it seems like the feds have actually found something valuable that they can use in their investigation against the music mogul. As the legal trouble for the bad boy intensifies, celebs who have been close to this man all this time face a tough choice, whether it's time to work with the authorities or lay low in hope that the storm will pass. Apparently, Mary J. Blige has made her brave choice. Not just for me, but for everybody else, because it was such a heavy time. And to hear everybody else's testimony, it was like, damn, like... Whether Diddy will face the consequences of his alleged misdeeds remains to be seen. But one thing is certain, both Mary and Diddy were embroiled in a dangerous game where the stakes couldn't be higher. As one person commented, oh no, MGB has been part of daddy's world from day one. The truth is coming Mary, you will go down with him. And another user added, Mary J, this is your time to release what was done to you. Cassie paved the way, so run with it and tell it all in a court of law. Put Diddy in federal prison where he belongs. Well, Diddy's future hangs on a thin thread, and probably those who were close to this man in the past are now facing the harsh reality to expose the truth about him or do down along the disgraced music mogul. But folks, what do you think about all this? Has Mary J. Blige known what Diddy is like? And will she be investigated as well? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to check my other videos.